clarifying my statement on the American budget, what I said was, or what I meant to say if it came across wrong, was currently our country budgets, budgets our money to spend 3% of our lump sum of, of money on infrastructure. And it plans to spend 4% on education. Well, if we spend more on infrastructure, then we're going to spend more than, than education. So that's what I'm trying to get. I'm trying to say we need to set our priorities straight. Um, next, Kelly and Tate have been doing a lot of comparing, comparing us to other countries and what they're what they've been doing. Well, last time I checked, we're not in a competition with other states, with other countries. We need to worry about ourselves and worry about where we are as a country. And comparing our us, ourselves to other countries just isn't fair because, like we said, like United uh, Emirates states or whatever the country is. Emirates. Emirates. Yes. Um, they're rich. They have money. They can spend. They can spend their money whatever way they want to. They want to spend it on. We don't have that kind of money right now, so we need to look at what we're using. And also, they talked about saving lives. They think that their infrastructure is going to save lives, but then they want to take money away from our military. I told you how many people are dying in our military. Do you think they need less money? Do you think that we we proved that through bridge collapses, which are the which relatively are the number one cause of deaths in infrastructure, only one in the past 50 years has been the result, a direct result of an infrastructure collapse. And that was Minneapolis, but the reason that happened was because it happened while they were fixing it. So that's just counterproductive. Um, you, uh, you said that the uh, presidential, presidential uh, candidates agreed on infrastructure, but there was no argument. Well, what side did they agree on? They didn't talk about it. So as far as I know, they agree that it's not a problem. <laughs> um, to conclude, I'd like to remind all of you that our country is in a tough position right now. We need to look at our priorities and make a decision that is better for our country. And that decision is to lay off infrastructure for right now and look at other things. Thank you. And remember, a vote for the negative is a vote for righteousness.